Jengo mifanyike vizuri. Jengo itajengwa sawa sawa hapa. Ili mimi nje nitakuja ku, kuzindua mpango ya hii ujengo haya. Sasa. Kwa sasa mimi mwenyewe nitatoa hapa laki moja kwa shule hapa. Mwalimu mkuu. Asante. Asante sana. Asante. Halafu wale vikundi ambao walitutumbuiza hapa. Mimi sasa nilikuwa vikundi vitano. Kila mmoja atapata 1000 wale uh, alafu wale watoto baba wamefika kwa shule baba kama ukuja watoto mpaka wapate peremende kunya soda kidogo ni unatoa kwa watoto hapa 1020 sasa sasa Asante sana. Sasa nataka niongee na wale wengine huko ambao wako Nairobi huko. Siku ya leo kumekuwa na taarifa katika gazeti ya Nation. There is today an article in the Nation which is talking about Azimio. That Azimio is actually uh, breaking up. I want to dispel in a rumor that is being spread by irresponsible irresponsible media that there is no danger in a new uh, collapsing any soon in time soon i really want our media to be responsible we want media to spread unnecessary and irresponsible propaganda nobody has left as new as new has remained intact except a few members of parliament who decided to take a walk But the leadership of Azimio is intact. There is no dissension. There is no disagreement anywhere in Azimio. And that's why we actually are taken aback to see a banner headline in a very uh, uh, senior media in the country. We want to say this is irresponsible journalism that must be discarded. We don't want the media to try to spread this dependency among the members of Azimio. We have stood very firm. Azimio is on a course of liberation of this country. Azimio, there may be sometimes disagreement of opinion on one issue or the other, but that itself does not mean in any way disintegration. So I want to turn from all our members, wherever they are, across the country, Azimio iko imara. Azimio is remaining united and Azimio will not break up anytime soon. We are on a course to liberate this country from the tyranny and irresponsibility. Second thing is that I have just read that the 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 uh, the, the CJ that is the the um, chief justice the head of judiciary has gone for a meeting with the president in the state house this in our view is an irresponsible move if there is supposed to be a dialogue this dialogue should be held in a neutral place state house is the head of the executive is the seat of the executive that's where the president decides If there's going to be a dialogue over issues of governance, the case must be should be held in a neutral ground. But this means that the judiciary itself is being compromised by the executive. The judiciary is being held hostage by the executive, and we've seen this before. We saw it happen under the rule of Mr. Moi, and we are try to question the current chief justice not to go to bed with the executive this is an unfortunate development 
and we want to hope that the rest of members of the judiciary are not going to be compromised. We want the judges to remain firm and uh, do their work in accordance with the law and the constitution of our country. This was a treatment that we wanted to make today. Thank you very much. God help Kenya. Asante sana. Asante sana. Asante.